Hey everybody, it's Mama J. Inspector. We are here with a challenge. We were challenged by the Nerd Bar. So we were tagged in a challenge from the Nerd Bar. It's called Fun With Funko Tag. Okay. All right. So we're going to go down the list. Tag your it. Thanks. No tag backs. No tag backs. Now I got to go find one of the damn cats. Um, okay. So we're going to go down the list. There's 10 questions. Okay. All right. So the first question is first ever Funko Pop. That was easy for me. That was incredibly easy for me. My first Funko Pop was the Diamond Eeyore. My first Funko Pop was Iron Man. Got him years before we even started this. That is true. That is true. All right. Second question is Fantastic Beast. Show a mythical preacher. That was pretty easy for me, too. I went with the Shinron from Dragon Ball Z. Figures. Well, I went with... I never realized how heavy this pop is. The Loch Ness Monster. So. All right, next question. A fighter. Favorite superhero pop? Went with Iron Man. All right, well, I'm going to go with, can you guess? Wonder Green Woman. Lantern. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> with Wonder Woman. This is one of my favorite Wonder Woman pops because this pop's really cool looking. All right, ready for the next one? Yeah. Newest pop. Well, we're going to solve that problem. We kind of went back and forth on our newest pops. So we're each going to open something that came in the mail, <laughs> and that'll be our newest pop. So, let me open this one first. I got a pop in a bag. Yeah, you got a pop in a bag. I hate yeah. them pop in a bag. I'm going to pull the pop protector out. I'll set the bag right there so the cat can chew on it. Alright, I've got a pop too. Yours is from... Hot Topic. And mine is from the Funko Shop. So, truthfully, I think this would have fell into mythical characters also. Okay. Oh, this is one of the stupid new boxes. And I got Medusa. Oh, that is so cool. I didn't even know that came out. Yeah. Medusa. Medusa. Oh, look. We can look at me. <laughs> this is actually a really cool pop. So what did you I get? Have... <laughs> I'm not going to read the label like I always do, because that's actually what's inside. Yeah. For once. But we have the... I never noticed that it says that, but I have Venomized Doctor Strange from Spider-Man Maximum Venom. I don't think the other ones say that. I don't think so either. So that's super cool. Uh, Doctor Strange is one of my favorite superheroes. Now I got a pop of him. Awesome. Alright, so next question is... Show your most expensive pop. We always fall into the same category. I have to show a pop that ended up going in Spectre's collection. Iron Man. <laughs> this particular one. It's in a hard stack. Yeah. For sure. And then, obviously, the Chase Broly. This was one of the first ones that we got that was a more expensive pop. And he has dropped in value since we got him, but still, it's in his protector. He's safe. All right, next one is your biggest pop. So it was pretty hard for me to pick this one. I went with Broly again. <laughs> That's fair. Um, but I think I do have a pop that stands a little bit taller than Broly. 
And it would be uh, Mount Lady. Oh, yeah. I, I do believe she stands taller than Bully in the box. Um, Put it right there. But, yeah. So, I, I think she stands just taller. So, I'm with Mount Lady. Funny, we don't collect uh, six-inch pops, but we've got three of them on the counter here. Yeah. Okay. Um, Two Dragon Balls and a My Hero. Okay, so the next one is from a galaxy far, far away. Show us Star Wars or a Disney pop. Yeah, you want to go first on this one? I'll go first. I'm going to do Star Wars. And I got a Wicket, which is an Ewok. That one's cool. He's very cool. We don't collect all of Star Wars, but I really like the Ewok, so I got this one. And I had to pick the greatest Disney princess of them all. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Deadpool! On a unicorn. Because nothing says Disney princess than a unicorn. That is true! <laughs> Alright, ready for the next one? Yep. Alright. Um, next one is... Show a scary pop. Okay. This was a little more difficult for us because we don't collect horror pops. Yeah, so I picked probably one of the scariest ones I own, and that would be the Hero Killer Stain. Well, I went with a rock pop, and I went with Eddie from Iron Maiden. Because we all know the number of the beast is 666, so what could be scarier than Eddie? So that's who I went with. Okay. Now we're down to number nine. Show a rare or obscure pop. I'll go first. Okay. So that was kind of a tough one, too. I went back and forth because, you know, we don't have a lot of limited edition. We do have some Chase and we do have some other ones. But I decided to go with a custom pop. So the custom pop that I decided to go with was the Venomized Hulk that was customized from Homespun Queen over at the Homespun Geeks channel. That is really cool. I didn't even know you had that. Yeah. This was the last one we won from them. And this is really amazing. Yeah, I like that it's only the Venomized parts that are... Yeah. And I mean, if you can see it, it it's, it's amazing. So this definitely will... It's a one of a kind, so... <laughs> Yeah. There we go. That's rare and obscure. Yeah, that one. We'll need to go. Um, so mine here. was also an easy one. It's clearly the Silver Age All Might. Because we only have 20 of them. So, really rare, really obscure. Not many people have these. Not many people have as many as me. He's being a smart aleck. Yeah, they don't have as many as you. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Last but not least. The question is... Fan zone. Show a TV series pop. So I went back and forth because I had a few. And I decided to go with one of my favorite TV series. And I went with, because I have the whole set, which is only two pops. <laughs> I went with Boy Meets World. Okay. So that is my favorite TV pop. We're to the point where you can't see us anymore. <laughs> yep. um, so I decided to fully exclude anime and TV shows from this and what would like live action. Okay. So it has to be Saturday Night Live. Did really you cow need bells. more cowbell? That's a cool pop. Love we got song. that at Tom's, right? I believe we got that at Tom's Models down in I LA. I believe so because I found it and I needed it because this was the best skit ever in Saturday Night Live. So now we have to tag two people. So we showed you our pops. Now it's time for you to show us yours. I am going to tag four pack. Oh, that's a good one. Because I'm going to get four responses. Then <laughs> I'm going to do one similar. I'm going to challenge uh, two boys and their pops. All right. So two boys and their pops and four pack. You have been challenged. Um, the list of questions is down below. And we can't wait to see your video. And again, Mark, there we go. No tag backs. <laughs> so we tag two other people and 
Shut off some pops. A lot of pops. A lot of pops. All right, guys. We'll see you in the next challenge. Bye. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together it's so beautiful. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell.